Welcome to the demo for BPS Explore. Uh, we're going to begin our journey on the BPS website and clicking on resources, BPS publications and books, and then on the button that says periodicals, and we're going to click on Clinical Psychology Forum. So this takes us directly into Clinical Psychology Forum on BPS Explore. Um, if you wanted to go back to the home page on Explore, we can click in the logo in the top right corner and that takes us back to the home page. You can see there's a, a top navigation here. We've got the different types of content. Uh, we have some information pages for various different audiences. And then we have a simple about us page that just explains about the BPS. So we're going to click through here and have a look at periodicals. And we can see all the different periodicals that are available on BPS Explore. And we're going to dive into Clinical Psychology Forum. And we can see here these articles are for the most recent issue that's just been published, um, a special issue on leadership and management. And then if we cast down here, we can click through into one of these articles. Now you can see at the moment, uh, we're only able to see the abstract, and this is how it would look to anyone who is not a member of DCP. Um, they can opt to log in and actually buy this content. But if you're a member of DCP, you can just simply log in. And this takes you to the BPS sign-in area. And I'm just going to log in with a test account here. And this person is a member of DCP, so they would get access to um, CPF. And actually, if we can see this little circular uh, here that's spinning around, um, that's just the system thinking, if you ever wonder why nothing's happening. So now that we're logged in successfully, you can see that's unlocked all of that content. Um, We've also got another tab where we can have a look at the figures and tables if you wanted to jump into any of those. And we can also have a look here at the DOI, that's the Digital Object Identifier. So it's on the article and then it's also on the PDF as well. So the DOI gives you an enduring link, which um, is, is really helpful for getting more citations. So that's the article PDF we can actually go back to the issue here by clicking on this link, issue 363, and we could actually get a PDF of that entire issue there. There's that one. And you're also able to, if I just go back into that article we were looking at, let's have a look at this one. There's another article there. All of the links are in orange. These are all of the references that appear throughout the article. Um, you can share this article on any of your social media. Um, you'll just need to log in with your own accounts there just to kind of get into your own social media. So if we think about how we would like to search within um, Clinical Psychology Forum, let me take you back to the home page. And I'm just going to put a key term in here. Let's put in leadership and hit search. So this is searching absolutely everything on BPS Explore. And you can see here it's telling us uh, what types of content have that word within their metadata. So actually what we could do is just um, filter those results so that we're just seeing um, periodical articles. So we can see here 111 different periodical articles have the word leadership in the metadata. Um, that would give you an idea of who else is writing about that subject. But if you wanted to filter it even more, you could say, let's look and let's see how many times the word leadership is within the metadata for Clinical Psychology Forum. And then we see that we're down there to 31 articles. And we can refine this even further. We could say, let's only have a look at everything that's been published in the last two years. Let's put in a date range of 22 to 23 and hit apply. And then those 31 articles is now down to five. 
So that just gives you an example of how you can use the filters on the left hand side there to actually hone down on the data results that you're looking for. So going back to the home page there, and then let's use that middle button to go into periodicals and then back into clinical psychology forum. So we've had a look at the articles in that latest issue. We can also have a look at the backlist as well. Um, our latest issue is 363. And actually with, um, with CPF, it goes all the way back to the beginning. And we, we're all the way back to 1986 with issue one, which you can also read as full text. There we are. So that's a very quick look at how you can um, dive into BPS Explore to have a look at CPF. Um, please do drop in and see, have a little look around all the other content types. We've also got reports and guidelines. And the same filters will work on those. So, if we search, let's search for leadership again. And that search the entire site. And then if we click on reports and guidelines, we can see that actually there is just one document that happens to be um, a clinical psychology one on leadership framework. So that gives you a quick idea of how those filters work. And um, thank you for listening. Goodbye.